Hey guys, welcome to Wrestling Days and welcome to the Bella Twins YouTube channel. Uh, this isn't a YouTube channel that we tend to visit, but obviously the news has broken through today that sadly John Cena and Nikki Bella have split up now. They'd been in a relationship for six years and actually we were only three weeks away from their wedding. Uh, this really is shocking news and... Um, it, you know, it's been reported by all the news outlets, all the big news organisations have jumped onto this story. Uh, wrestling fans are shocked uh, and are quite invested in this relationship. John Cena being arguably the biggest WWE superstar uh, at the moment, you know, Brock Lesnar, of course, and Roman Reigns. But you have to mention John Cena, one of the all time greats. Um, but then you've got shows like Total Bellas. Total Divas that really focus quite heavily on this relationship. And then not only that, at WrestleMania 33, John Cena actually proposed to Nikki Bella in the middle of the ring after their match. That whole match and the build-up to that match that they had against The Miz and Maurice really focused on their relationship, really focused on Nikki Bella and John Cena. So whether you're a wrestling fan that cares about this relationship or whether you're a wrestling fan that doesn't care about this relationship, it was impossible to not be aware of it and have it kind of shoved in your face 24-7 uh, one way or another. So uh, yeah, it is big, big news uh, that that relationship has come to an end. Um, everything I can find out Looking back at old Instagram posts and tweets and reading loads of articles, I've put it all into one video. Uh, it's all the latest news, all the latest info that we know about the breakdown in that relationship. Um, you know, I do understand and respect they need their privacy, um, but you know, there's people out there that want to know why did this relationship fail. Um, and everything I can find, I've put it into a video. There's a link on screen at the moment. If you click on that, if you want to find out more information about that, check that video out. This video is going to be taking a look at something that happened only the other week. Um, John Cena and Nikki Bella had a custom-made Mattel figure set. Now, there's only one of these in the world. I'd seen pictures of it, but I haven't seen any video footage of it. And uh, basically, Mattel have made, tried to recreate, if you will, that moment when John Cena proposed to Nikki Bella. This was shown at WrestleMania Access, and WrestleMania Access is the fan convention that WWE put on in the days leading up. To WrestleMania and this year's WrestleMania was in New Orleans, uh, WrestleMania 34 and so we will join Nikki Bella and Brie Bella having a look at WrestleMania access. They do see this item and I think it will be very interesting to see, you know, how does Nikki react to seeing this because if there's problems in the relationship, if the relationship is on the verge of breaking down, there's every chance that she shies away from it, isn't that enthusiastic about it. Or if everything was okay just the other week, maybe she's excited, maybe she's enthusiastic, maybe, I don't know, you know, she's taking pictures or whatever. So I think this is going to be very, very interesting. So let's get straight to the video and see how does Nikki Bella react to this. This is the Mattel... St uh, has she seen it? That's quick if she has. She has? And she's taking pictures? I mean, it is cool. Look at that. It's a one of a kind. There's Brie as well. Is that their mom? Is that their mom? I think that's their mom. <laughs> she's excited about the shoes. <laughs> Wow, so Nikki actually urging Mattel to make it and calling John Cena Superman. So she is not shying away, is she at all? Daniel Bryan right next to me, like, 
<laughs> What's Brie going on about? I think Brie wants her own figure. <laughs> Yeah, it was. It was all over. It is a great set. I'm not gonna lie. I felt pretty amazing and special walking up to this. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, talking about it being a magical moment. I mean, look at that Mattel display as well. So really, really interesting. You know, not only did she go over and take pictures, she's actually saying. Make this, please, Mattel. People out there want it. They want me, her Wonder Woman. They want John Cena, Superman. You know, she's she's really bigging it up. There's no signs there of any problems in a relationship or anything like that. And that was literally last week. Uh, so really, really interesting stuff. Um, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I'm very interested as to what you think is happening at the moment. I don't think this is fake. I don't think that, you know, they'll get back together in a few days' time. I don't think they're doing this for headlines, anything like that. Um, I, don't, I also don't think Mattel are going to make those figures. Uh, but it is interesting to see, you know, Nikki seemed to react then as if everything was okay. She wanted those figures made, um talking about John Cena being a Superman. Mm, interesting stuff. As I said, if you haven't seen that video uh, that I did, check it out. I'll put a link at the end uh, because John Cena did send out those tweets just a few days ago that seemed to imply that mistakes had been made. And he was talking about, you know, you, sometimes you have to stand up to your mistakes and all that kind of stuff. And, well, I don't know. Has he made a mistake here? Uh We'll have to find out, um, and I'm sure we will find out in the coming days. So uh, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments below, and hopefully I'll see you again next time. Bye for now.